Xalophone here with Mario for a special auto deck building challenge. Since we now have access to an automatic deck builder that's working in Yu-Gi-Oh! Omega, we are going to challenge each other to auto build a deck with just four card picks. Now, of course, we had to throw a wrench into it, and we'll each be choosing two of our opponent's cards as well, just to mix up the deck and see how bad it becomes. So I'm going to start off kind of sane here, and let's just go with the blue eyes white dragon. Sure, okay. it bricks, but... What could possibly go wrong? Why don't we go X head cannon? Oh no, we got like Kaiba vibes in here. Okay, you yeah. want X head cannon or one of like the bigger ones? Eh, just X head cannon. Okay. Might not have impact me too much. Okay, so we got that to deal with. There's some normalness going on, but we really want to drag it in the blue eyes direction. Um, oh, what if we just add the new blue eyes fusion thing? What is that even called? Darn it, I guess I need to be able to remember the name of the Ultimate part. Fusion? I... Was it? It might be a terrible pick, but it might also completely dominate the deck. And, you know, who knows? Maybe not. Okay, won't be able to be helpful for anything else. But what's your final wrench? Rainbow Dragon. Okay. That could either completely destroy this entire deck or just not work. <laughs> so let's auto deck build and see what happens. Oh, we got Kaijus. Oh, there's definitely a fusion angle here. So that worked out. <laughs> All right, I don't think you got me too bad, Mario. I don't think you got me too bad. In fact, all right, this, all right. this is almost a deck that I would build. With Rainbow Dragon in it? No, as I suspected, the Rainbow Dragon just dead and useless. But hey, all right. you know, we'll see. What's your first card, Mario? Ooh, this one's going to be... Let's... Uh, let's. You pick Blue Eyes, right? Yep. I'm going to pick Red Eyes. All right. Let's see. I'm going to see if you can uh, twist this into your favor here. Oh, wait, no. I'm going to do that at the end. All right, I will give you malefic blue eyes malefic blue oh my okay Maybe that'll throw you off a little <laughs> all right then i will go you picked a fusion but i want i don't want to go completely like you so mm -hmm. i will instead pick malefic blue eyes so we should go full blue eyes a uh, red dragon angle and see if that works out in our favor possibly so let's do the Red Eyes Meteor Black me Dragon. Okay, so it's still gonna give you a little fusion direction. Now I'm between two options. One that would kind of make the deck try to work and one that will just throw it off entirely and might ignore. But we're gonna go with Zombie World. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna do it, but we'll see. All right, Red Eyes, Malefic Blue Eyes, Red Eyes Black Meteor Dragon, and Zombie World. Hit it. All right. Auto deck build. Mm -hmm. Okay. I got rockets and ten yees. <laughs> Is there any Never zombie stuff? I'm just curious. Um, no, it's nah. just floating in here. All right, wasn't as much of a wrench as I'd hoped. But let's get into it and duel. And let's begin. So my deck, I think, is gonna do all right. It's just like a baddish blue eyes deck. For so me, good. it's weird to say. It's a mix of wyverns and dragons. So I don't know why the wyverns were mixed into this. Yeah, fun. But you got first turn. Couple blue eyes cards I don't use too much. I do have King of the Swamp actually, for fusion angles. Actually, I can see what the deck was trying to do, actually. Okay. I'm gonna set this card down. Set this card down and end the turn. All right, let's go for it. I don't have anything for cards of continents. So let's just go immediately for Keeper of Dragon Magic. Activate its effect. Honestly, don't love King of the Swamp. I know he's usable with this hand, but we're gonna toss him for now just as material. Oh, we, we just get basic poly in anyway. Okay, doesn't do anything too fantastic for us. But I hate poly so much that I'm just gonna use it. And we will go for Twin Burst. Cause I had two raw blue eyes. Can't go too wrong here. Uh, now, what else can this guy do again? You know, we. You can uh, fusion something. You can reveal one fusion monster from your extra deck. Do something. I'm just going to activate and see what happens. Um, alternative. So then I can special summon. In defense mode, the blue eyes as potential material for later summonings. Okay, neat. Um, battle phase. I seem to have a good little arraignment of things. I... I can't believe you brought a twin burst turn one. Yeah, as I said, it's not bad. Ooh, black metal. Okay. Solid red eye play all around. Mm-hmm. This allows me to get my Red Ice Fusion. Oh, okay. Real scared then. 
Although your thing can't be targeted, so. Yeah, it still can get killed, so. Wait. Oh, wait, no, it just says it can't be destroyed by battle. Oh, well, yeah. Get right around it. I have Ooh, sector, sector launch. Allowing me to special summon the, uh, these two. Oh, man, if this deck is built to set you up with a Borload Savage Dragon comboed with a, uh, thing, that'd be crazy with Dragoon. Select a face-up card destroy. I guess I will just remove the boot sector launch. Okay. To special summon an additional monster. Nice, nice. Then... Tributing... These... Two... Yeah. Bring out this. Tribute summon Flare Dragon, okay. Oh, that's what I should have done. Okay. I forgot that this guy is level four. I should have kept one of the level one tuners instead. Gone into one of my late level eight synchros that that gave me. Oh, interesting. Okay. It gave me Beals of the Diabolic Dragons <laughs> and Scarlet Red Dragon Archfiend. Oh, Scarlet would have been fantastic right now. Goodbye, Let's get rid of that keeper. guy. All right, so it seems to be in my favor significantly right here. That's not too bad. Get rid of the rocket tracer itself. Bring that back. All right. Synchron comes out. We're going to switch this boyo up right here. And not really any good reason to summon this. So we'll just wait. We'll just wait. Uh, do we have tuners in this tech? No, we do not have any blue eyes tuners, unfortunately. Okay. It definitely has like a somewhat meta direction, the deck, but it's also well, like yeah. some not stuff as well. All right. Use our two attacks, twin burst to our advantage and get a little white lightning on you for extra damage. Yeah, it is gonna hurt. Ow. All right, I think that's the full extent of what I got though. Oh, that's good. Just kind of the, messed up at the beginning, but I think I understand what the deck is now. Okay. Yeah, I just got a lot of, like, basic blue eyes support. Wait. Is that why? Like this guy. Oh, no. Please do not tell me that that the deck added in Red Eyes Fusion and Dragoon. No Dark Magician. <laughs> it does not have a Dark Magician. No. Ah, we 100% did up. some test runs with this uh, mechanic, and it did add in a... It added in red eyes for like my Dark Magician deck or something. So, wow. You have a basic red eyes in there. Okay, it doesn't matter. Hey. Oh, yeah. And I only, think it, it doubles, doubles its attack, the basic right? Red eyes. This is, it I, does it, count as basic. The number should have popped up if it does, I'm pretty sure. Let's I, see, does it? I don't it? think it just happens in the battle. Darn it! Thought it might have been that case. Darn it, that, that seems like a good strategy to do. Yeah, no, if there was a regular Red Eyes in your grave, which in most Red Eyes decks happens all the time, would have been. Um, all right. One, well, I haven't incorporated too much. Run it now back. I know what to do now. Oh, I chose second, but would you like me to uh, turn pass? Or would you like to sure. turn pass? Yeah, I'll just turn pass. The game's moving so quick, you know? Oh, so we got another keeper play. I think it's absolutely a keeper play type of moment. Activate. We'll toss the Abyss Dragon in. Now... We don't really have a lot to do here, but we'll get rid of that. And now, hmm, what is this going to turn into? I guess I got to find out. Oh. Okay. Thank you, King of the Swamp. You jealous? get your dragoon? We jealous out here? Yes, very. I didn't know about that combo. I never thought about that combo. Um, so you could use Keeper of the Dragon Magic and King of the Swap because it's specifically named Dark Magician. Yeah, because it, it needs to be the specific name. So that's why King of the Swamp's in here. Uh, you know what? Just to mess with you, <laughs> zombie world. Nice. I was half tempted to like start to build a zombie deck for myself and then give you zombie world. But if that were the case, you would have had no reason to play it. So uh, you can easily counter that big brain move. Now I'm wondering if its effect will still be in full. Ooh, it's not letting me activate the effect at all. 
so that's fun. But, of course, it's still great and has negates and all that good stuff. And that's all I'm going to be able to do right now. So, battle. Because I cannot do the destroy thing since neither of the cards I got rid of are Red Eyes or Dark Magician. But there I go again. Time I'm not going to get a Red Eyes fusion. Okay, I might as well just negate that. Darn it. Uh, what do we toss? What do we toss? Um, Polly. We don't have material on us anymore. It's the most polys I've ever used. Be okay, so I'm going to do this, which is going to have me discard my Nocto Vision. I'm going to destroy my own zombie world. All right. Just so I can do this. Uh -oh. Activate <laughs> to bring that back out. Okay. You know, we'll let some we'll let some plays go through. I'm sure I can stop it right Yeah, because but... Dragoon, yeah. <laughs> Dragoon is a big old tough one to get rid of. We want to see some action. Now, synchroing these two off. Beautiful Beals. It's a lovely standoff we have. Well, my car can't be destroyed by battle. Yeah. Nice. All right, we'll see if I can bounce back now. Because that was obviously, like, much better play. Ooh, cards of consonants can actually be used now. Ooh. Oh, here's our X-Head Cannon. <laughs> <laughs> buy X head cannon, be my material. <laughs> uh, you can still, oh yeah, you can't be destroyed by battle or card effects. Ooh. I can add rainbow dragon to my hand. Wait, you can add rainbow dragon yeah. to your? It's oh, a I dragon did not know that. Three thousand or more attack and twenty five hundred or more defense. But you know, melody of awakening adds two things instead of a rainbow dragon deck when you're gonna want to add two rainbow dragons to your hand. I wonder if Melody's good enough to put into like a regular crystal beast deck actually. Well that's what I was just saying when do you want to add two? Well because you have the other form of it remember? Isn't that like extra deck though? Or ooh. No. I don't know if the, uh, the other form might be high Zenith, Zenith is also a 3k I think right? Uh, yeah I don't know it's defense but maybe. Uh, okay so I will now reveal the blue eyes in my hand so I can summon Nebula Dragon. And oh, I did it in the wrong order. Oh, well, it's kind of what I Well, they're both effects do. are negated anyway, so. Well, yeah, I'm not trying to use effects. Oh, you were trying to alternate, weren't you? Yeah, I want to pull out alternate. Obviously, alternate would not uh, destroy you by any means, but looks like we got a nice, lovely play here. Now, you cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. However, yeah. um, do I have... No, I don't have one of the uh, Cypher Dragons to... Oh, thank up. goodness. Yeah, stop that from happening. Oh, actually. Yeah, this will do. Uh, we are going to go into... I need something big and strong. So, we're going to try to grouply on play. Activate. Detach the blue eyes. Might be useful later. And special summon the... Hmm. I guess Tachyon. It's not the normal plays that I go for in here. Not that I know the best plays or anything, but... So we'll get that out. Ooh, okay. And then... I guess if we just Dark Ruler no more you, we should still be fine. And three attacks on monsters. Okay, so either way, I don't deal damage. I just want to kill. Get Beals off the track. Well, let's see if this works. Ah! <laughs> Lovely. The deck put in a plain old mirror force in the deck. Yep. I had to work for that, too. Nice. Yeah. Okay, uh, Mario. Yeah. Right. It's going to be tough for me to bounce back off this. I think I may have this round. Yeah. You got a graveyard full of dragons, but not a lot of ways I can think of using them. If I, nah, drew, if I, I was... draw my uh my fusion right now. <laughs> nah, if you draw if you draw Rainbow Dragon, that'd be good. <laughs> <laughs> That's not gonna cut it. Uh, what is this guy? Well, speaking up, by the way, by the time this recording comes out, I don't know if it's gonna change anything, but we just got some new Crystal Beast support. Hey, cool. Definitely try something out with that. I uh, actually, yeah, that's perfect. Adding uh, raw blue eyes back to hand so we can get alternative out onto the field. We still need to get a little clever somewhere, but that's fine. Rocket Tracer wants to activate, I'm sure. Yep. And this can add a, a poly, but I think the deck only did have two polys in it. 
Mm, would that actually help me out at all? Well, that would be a funny standoff, if anything. I guess there's no harm in me trying. Well, this can add a light pooner to my hand. And then send it to the graveyard. Especially some of the blue eyes from the deck. But that also doesn't save me. I could just go for more eights. But I kind of did my like primary eight play. And this one... Hmm. I think would work. Okay. We'll run it back. Alright, we will go with Sage. Now. It's normal summons, you can add a tuner, you can discard, oh, I need to discard it to do it, and I can't discard it. Hmm. Alright, so, we're going to start with alternative, get him on the field. Obviously you can't be disturbed by card effects, so that's not going to be any big play of mine. Okay, then I guess we're going to need to put this boy on the field. I guess the only real thing is if you're able to get, like, enough damage onto Rocket Trace for a one-turn kill, but... Yeah, I mean, if that was, a, like, the Tachyon Dragon play, then maybe, but it's just not. And then we can activate this, destroy that, forsaken it for a regular blue eyes, so we got that up there. Um, now, can we summon the boy? Yeah, I guess this is the right play, but it's not, like, a lot. We could just Twin Burst against you, but that doesn't change anything. Um, but this might do it. We'll, we'll run it. Wait, no. <sighs> okay, so I'm looking at Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon number 107. And this, I detach, negate all your stuff. Fantastic. However, I will no longer have my alternative on the field to be able to pop you. So that's a big problem. And um, your original attack and defense become your original. Okay, so it actually won't do anything. If I activated this, then this card gains that. But then you just attack me next turn. <laughs> I guess I still do it. Maybe I just have to wait. Either way, we're gonna go for the pop. Ow. Alright. And... Yeah, because I got ways to boost up the power of a blue eyes, funny enough. But not... Did deal me a little damage, but not enough to kill. Yeah, exactly. So, we're just gonna go into the Tachyon Dragon. Once again, one I haven't used substantially before. Ooh. And... I can go into battle phase, lets me activate the effect, sending the regular blue eyes back down, your effect is negated, however, it's a crash at this point. Do I gamble a crash with a brick eyes deck, or do we wait to see what you can do? Because during battle phase, um, each time an opponent's card effect, oh wait no, and we're just gonna crash, whatever. Might not be the All best right. move when I'm down life points, but... No, I got some graveyard stuff. Wonderful. I drew in Red Eyes Fusion. Ah, <laughs> sad. Okay. It's so weird when you get a bad draw that is Red Eyes Fusion. Right? Yeah. All right, well, I didn't get much either. Okay, this actually have my Rocket Tracer, Ooh, which allows me... Right I can bring back Beals with it? Yeah, no, rock. Th this is the time in the duel to use a Rocket Synchron Possum. Like, at best. Do I bring back Beals or do I go into like nines. Scarlight? I think Beals is as good for this situation. There, here's oh, where wait, if you're running that, a uh, deck that you can climb to nine. Right. You're in business. Uh, no, there's no level nine. I should have gone with the other one because I forgot the effects are negated and it's put in defense mode. Yeah, I guess that kind of kind of ruins it, doesn't it? Yeah, it's okay, really just to climb Rocket Synchron. Here, here's what I'll do. Using the, this one, I'll go into Striker Dragon. That one will allow me to get a Boot Sector launch of the hand. Can at least get some Link players out of it. Then, target one face of card on the field, destroy it. I'll get rid of that. To mm -hmm. add to the hand, another Rocket Synchron back to the hand. Okay. This will allow me to special <laughs> summon it. Nice. That effect only goes off when it's normal summon, that being said. Yeah, I just remember that. Mm -hmm. Still, you wipe my field. I shame you. Oh, actually, it's fine. Yeah, 250 defense anyway. My two cards are freaking Red Eyes Fusion, Zylo. Red Eyes Fusion. I got two raw blue eyes. <laughs> oh, wait. Can I? 
We're in a, we're in a risky spot right here. Funny enough, I uh, just I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Time. It's it's too funny not to do it. All right, let's go. Red eyes, black dragon. Ooh, that's actually quality plays. Now it's just down to my last draw. That was because I could have, I could have done the same thing and gone straight into Scarlight instead. But red eyes, I need to go into my original board right here. <laughs> A couple turns no. ago, that would have been nice, but uh, I lose. <laughs> no, that is dirty. It is. It's just a spiteful kaiju. Camera to finish it. All right, round three, round three. I would like to oh, more even than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, can never complain about drawing a melody. Actually, this hand might be golden. All right, discard that. Can I summon five headed? Nope, I don't have. Okay. To bring out the one for one. Then I also activate the quick launch. This allows me to special summon one rocket from my deck. Okay. And I will add the rocket dragon. Lovely. Then. I suppose this is the best card to use it on. Using these two, I bring out Samsara, Dragon of Rebirth. And of course, since Black Metal Dragon was into the grave, I can oh, add yeah. a new card to the hand. That's one of the reasons I like my Red Eye Synchro deck so much, just because, like, between getting the uh, Synchro Place climbing and then just, well, Black Metal Dragon's getting sent for free. Why not? Yeah, that's true. This is honestly probably just a not better, but better idea a red eye synchro deck by the look of things because you got like the uh obviously the rockets mixed stents there which are objectively good and i just don't mm -hmm. use too much of all right i'll keep some options in the hand for later on the okay. turn oh my god that's a normal summon as well now all right melody hit me up we send that we add three blue eyes to hand um so i want you to just summon the exact cannon one silo <laughs> uh, i could have searched that there but i didn't all right, nice. I forgot I was doing that, so that's cool. Uh, neat. We will then special summon this. Really should have. What was the two cards you picked for me? I know one of them was Zombie World. I, um, the cards I picked for you: Zombie World and what was the other one? I don't know. Malefic Blue Eyes, which I've not seen once. Hmm. Activate this so we can summon that for free. And summon that for free. Activate this. Pop that. Good Dragon Goodbye. Rebirth goes off. Nice. Which allows me to special summon a dragon or from the grave. Or dragon or any monster, actually. Yeah, one monster in either player's graveyard. Basically, it's a monster reborn, so... Hmm. Neat. Alright. We will also Keeper of Dragon Magic. I think it's safe. No, it wouldn't be safe to use its effect like I wanted to. Discard a card and add poly. Nah, we won't. I've okay. not seen you use Nebula Dragon before, honestly. I've used him a bunch of times in my level 8 uh, Blue Eyes decks. I guess he just doesn't pop up as much as the other cards then. Maybe. Okay, so he's out here, so obviously. Um, well, that's the play we want to go for anyway, you know? Do that, do that, that. Oh, I could have done the big play. Oh, well. This is fine. Do that. We'll keep a Blue Eyes in hand because there's more alternatives in this deck. And yes, of course, destroy that. And I believe activate the effect. Target one card your opponent controls. Destroy it. Buy mirror force. Oh, Ooh, fun. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I am afraid nothing. Oh, yeah, he doesn't get to use his effect anymore, so we'll just attack right there. Yeah, you're right. Mirror force. Ah, nice. Darn it. Fortunate. <laughs> End turn. Darn it. How do I kill the blue eyes alternate dragon? Um, let's see. Cannot just. Can't do it with card effects. Can't destroy or target with card effects, rather. So those two specifics. And that's it. Yeah. So just by battle. I have to overpower yeah. that like thing? Like, if it was any other Mirror Force, you would have gotten him. Um, if it's anything that does, like, a wide send or return. But, yeah, target and destroy won't be working. All right. So I'll do this. By sending away my Red Eyes Black Meteor Dragon that is treated as the Red Eyes, mm -hmm. I can bring out Blue Eye Red Eyes Alternative Dragon. Yeah, Mete Red Eyes Meteor Black Dragon will count, will it? Um, I mean, it might. It just 
it's not gonna double the attack. Yeah, because you need a raw yeah. red eyes, which most red eyes decks are fantastic at just sending raw red eyes into the grave. But uh, all right, I'll go for that. Add another one of these boys to hand. Why not? And can we do anything fancy fancy with it? If I got another card, then yes. But I think for now we're just gonna hold on to my material and hope this all works. Now, if I do that, I can target three cards and destroy instead, and I can't attack when I do all that. So we're just gonna attack. It's safe. I'll turn it off. Permit. Mirror oh, Force again. That's sad. Yeah, I, I started to duel with two Mirror Forces, so. Still puts you something on the field at the very least. Yeah. Oh, that's not gonna help. Oh, no. Yeah. Fair, fair choice. Another melody? Okay. We'll do that. We're just going to send that away for fun. This becomes your new favorite Blue Eyes deck. It's actually <laughs> kind of great. It's like better than my Blue Eyes Fusion decks. Um, we'll do that. And I don't think I can do anything with the Rainbow Dragon. Yeah, because all this one's like Blue Eyes specifically. Um, yep. We're just going to chill and add another Blue Eyes to the hand. Why not? Neat. Alternative. Come on out, buddy. Do your thing. You can activate your effect for free. Then, how does this work again? Activate. We do that. Poly. Oh, it just switches it out. Never mind. Could have done bigger things with that. But we're just gonna... Ah, darn it. Do we not have another copy? We don't have another copy of Alternative Ultimate Dragon. Otherwise, I would have been able to summon another one just there. And battle. It's a decent blue eyes fusion deck. And I'll take the win. Woo! That was All fun. right. I like that auto deck build. Also, a lot less work for us. Yeah, honestly. If you guys, if you guys like this, honestly, we're down to do this again. Ooh, what if we go completely random? Like we pick two cards that don't fit into an archetype, and then you go with that, and then see what big makes it out of it. Yeah, true. There's a lot of ideas we can do with this. So. Hey, if you got some crazy ideas in your mind, put them in the comments down below. Leave a like on this video if you've enjoyed, and subscribe so you don't miss it when it comes. We'll see you next time. See you, folks.